What's up fellow engineers, Dr McKay here, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, is I'm going to be talking about advanced symmetry mode. Now I've talked about symmetry mode in the past, and I've only really showed you one option you could do. Now in this one, we're going to be just show, I'll be showing you how to do multiple symmetry mode, or multiple symmetries on the same block. So I've got a little test bed set up here, I've got one single small grid block on a large grid rotor, so I can show you it with small grid, so it's a lot easier than large grid. So basically, make sure you're in creative mode, then go to basically place a the block, then press right stick, comes up with the build menu. Now go down to the bottom right where it says enter symmetry mode setup, now it's basically all the same as the last video. Now once you're in, the symmetry mode setup, you'll come up with the like red, red box line. Now, if you, so if you, want, so you definitely want this one. So you press right on the D-pad, and then now you press down, and it changes the line. But you don't want that one. You could have that one. I normally go for the blue one. So you press right again, and it'll set it. Now to exit, it, you can either continue to press down until your blocks appear, or you can press right bump, uh, right stick, and then go to like enter symmetry mode setup, and it'll get rid of it. But now you have symmetry mode setup on both sides of the block. Easier, so you could just do that, and do that. Now, if you've seen my Falcon 9 videos, this is how I've made the Falcon 9, by using symmetry mode setup just like this. Alright? But, if you're building, say, let's say you're building up like that, <clears throat> and then, I don't know, like that, but then you only wanted to do, say, one connector, let me find the connector, let's say you get a connector, as you notice, if I was to place it there, it makes one on the other side, but if you don't want that, because if you was to delete that one, it deletes both of them. So when you're aiming at the block and you've got the symmetry mode highlighted, press left bumper and then left on the D-pad and it'll get rid of it. But, if, but don't worry, it's not gone so you don't have to set it up again. So place what you wanted and then aim back at the block or the your grid, press left bumper again and then left on the D-pad and it'll place the symmetry mode back again. So you have nothing to worry about without doing it, without losing it. And there you have it. Have you noticed? As I went up, it's gone over on top of the connector, and basically the same here. Oh, it just comes out on the other side, and then you literally can build wherever you want. Very easy, just using two sides. So if you're doing like a four-sided object, then and you need it to do that, that's what I do, and that's how I built Falcon 9 in my videos. There is other forms of symmetry mode. So we just see if I can demonstrate. So obviously to get rid of it, you press left and then left on the D-pad again. And it should get rid of them both. I think you have to go to the Pacific color. Yeah, I think that's how it is. Yeah, so basically to get rid of it, you basically press down to go to the the symmetry mode you did and then press left and it will get rid of it so now let me just go back into it again let's just try the green so what does the green do i wonder probably does up and down yeah so let's just come out and we have a little look yeah, yeah it does up and down so you could literally do any direction you want so now you know how to do multiple symmetries on the same grid and then you can have all of them if you wanted to you could literally have like left the right up and down as I've just shown you there and obviously you know how to get rid of them so if you found this video helpful and you liked it please leave me a like and leave me a comment if you have any questions or if you have any other videos you want me to do and if you haven't already please subscribe for more of my content I've been Dr. McKay, and as always, happy building, and I'll catch you next time. Cheers.